Welcome to Inner Frames. I am Rakesh Babu. In this series, we will explore the world of innovation and frame the wow moments. How do you like your coffee? Hot or cold? Well, this question became relevant only after a creative genius innovated on the traditional hot beverage that the world loves. Here is the actual incident of the frappe for you. Coffee, best known hot beverage, is today available in many versions. Before iced lattes, freddo, cappuccinos, frozen mocha latte, the world had only one cold choice, the most popular cafe frappe. The Greeks loved frappe so much that it was the undisputed summer favorite. Did the cafe frappe emerge out of the blue? Or was there a creative genius with a stroke of luck and thirst for experimentation led to the innovation? During 1957 Thessaloniki's summer trade fair in Greece, an employee of Nescafe wanted to make his favorite cup of coffee using instant coffee powder, but could not get hot water. Dimitris Vakondios took a chocolate shaker that Nescafe was promoting at the trade fair and mixed Nescafe with cold water. He mixed instant coffee, water, sugar and milk along with a few ice cubes. He used the shaker to create a frothy drink. This improvisation proved so successful that it was introduced as a product by Nescafe. It became a household drink and even tourists started falling in love with the taste of Nescafe Frappe. The innovation was not just adding cold water to coffee, but the initial shaking and mixing of the coffee with small amount of water to create a good frothy drink that did the trick. Frappe foam is similar to crema, the foam found in espresso but thicker and longer lasting due to its oil-less composition. It is a three-phase colloid of air bubbles, coffee solids and water. Today, there are many variants and flavors of the frappe. There are frappe brewers, blending stations, vending machines which prepare the much-loved drink frappe. There are over 1,500 patents granted for innovations around this popular drink. The patents are for frappe flavors, mixes, machines, wendies and other categories. The use of cold water and ice cubes instead of hot water is an application of tool invert in the functional innovation toolkit. This tool is known to generate radical ideas. Next time you take a sip of frappe, remember that someone tried experimenting and that is the reason we get to enjoy the perfect Greek iced coffee. Do subscribe to this channel and stay tuned for another exciting episode of Inner Frames. Until then, bye.